Hey guys, it's Mandy from Daydream Face Painting. Um, today I'm going to show you this Hot Wing Steamy Stencil, and this is the Wing Ding that comes with it. Um, when I first saw these, I thought you had to hold it on your face like this and do the whole big design, and I wasn't quite sure how to use them, but I watched the video tutorial how to use them, and I understand them a lot better now. So you have to think of it kind of like a graffiti stencil where there are all these different elements that you can use and you can twist it any way you want. You can use this part if you were doing an eyeshadow and you wanted to just have a nice tight line. You could use it like that and the wingding if you want to block out an element. Um, let's say you only wanted this top part of the gear. You would use the wingding on top, just hold them together, and then do your design that way. And then also, I use, in this video, I use star blends with this, with a lollipop blender. And the cool thing about that is star blends are dry, so I did both of the eyes, and I could immediately just wipe it off, switch it to the other side, and apply the eye design. So that's one good thing about using star blends with these, which I did not realize you could do. So um, I really like these. Yeah, it's very cool. So I'm just using a Fantasy Worldwide sponge cut into a teardrop shape and I'm loading up some tag pearl white, metallic gold, and metallic copper here. And I'm just gonna go on the eye, into the corner, and a little bit above the eye area. So here I'm continuing to dab around the forehead and eye area. I'm going for a washed out kind of um, aged metal look here. So I added a little more water to my sponge just to make it look a little bit lighter, going for an aged metal effect. So here I'm holding the hot wings up kind of where I want it and I'm using a lollipop blender with black star blends on it to make the design. It works really easily. So I'm going to flip the stencil to the other side and apply the wing on the other eye. You can see how just this design by itself, if you were doing a one-eye design, would be really cool for a teen or an adult, and it would be ultra, ultra fast. So without reloading my lollipop blender, I'm just using the large gear area of the stencil and going over and smudging it out. I wanted a really smoky kind of washed out effect here in this area. You could also use the same stencil for boys' designs. You could use the gears for a robot design, or you can use them kind of as a wheel design as well. A few of them would work for that. Here I'm going to use something you probably already have in your kit to add a little bit of beauty makeup to this design. It is red and orange star blends mixed together applied with a Q-tip. Now I'm going to go in with a little bit of black star blends on the q-tip to add the darkened areas on the outer corners of the eyes.
Now I'm going to use the clean side of my Q-tip to kind of go in and smudge everything out a little bit. This is a lot easier with a real makeup brush, a real eyeshadow brush, but we're going to make it work with the Q-tip because that's what we all have in our kit. Now I'm going to go in with a little bit of Global Strong Black on a low Cornell number 4 brush. And I'm going to add dots, three dots to the corners of the eyes. And then I'm going to go to the outside and make three dots there as well. One, two, three. Now I'm going to go in with Suzy Sparkles Glitter Gel and add some glitter gel dots on top of the black just for a little bit of sparkle and extra dimension. I'm using Tag Copper on a brush to fill in the lip area. And once that's dry, I'm going to go in with some black star blends around the edges of the mouth just to give the lip a little bit of smokiness and dimension. And for the final touch, I'm going to go in with a little bit of tag metallic gold just in the very center of the lips and I'm going to smudge it out with my finger. That's the finished design. Hope you guys like this design and you can try it out at your next event. Thanks for watching.